one thing about me is just learning to embrace things that society deems as not beautiful. Not beautiful. girl Chrissy and I'm back with another video so this time I'm going to be doing a Shein haul mini haul I really be trying to like rack in my brain like what's the what's the difference between like a mini haul and like a full haul I don't know I think I'm like in the middle of like a mini and a full but anyways uh Shein sent me about six things um, and I'm here to show y'all because I was trying to keep it like vacation inspired ish um, or just like cute clothes for plus size women. Um, so let's jump right in. Uh, so this is the first outfit that I put together. And you know, y'all, my mom used to like get on my case about like I would just buy something just because I thought it was cute and I wouldn't have nothing to go with it. And I will always tell her. I'll find something to go with it, you know, eventually. And now I see what she was talking about. So now I shop in, you know, like trying to put a full outfit together. Because who got time to be waiting, honey? So uh, this top and this skirt are both from Shein. First of all, the skirt is giving, it's giving, I need some salsa lessons. It's giving Tulum. It's giving vacation, honey. That's what this is giving. And I was just like, let me just pick like a little... You know, a basic top to go with it. I could definitely spice it up a little bit with the top, though. Um, but it has, like, these, like, tassels and the print. It's just giving everything, like, that I need. So let's do a 360 so you see how it fully looks. And, yeah, this is, like, super cute. <laughs> I'm like, this is a cute, this is a very cute skirt. Um, and I think I might get some of the other colors too. Now, what I wanted to point out, because at first I was I was concerned. I can't lie. I was concerned, like, it's going to be too short. My vagina is going to show. Something like that. And honestly, like, okay, it's this, like, part that's coming. Oops, hope that didn't just flash the screen, honey. But it's this part that's coming across that's covering my vagina. But I would definitely make sure that I wear like some type of short or something under this. Like, I just don't be trusting clothes. Now, thankfully, the bottom is like, you know, it's long enough. Because um, I do have a long booty. That's neither here nor there, though. <laughs> Anyways, um, so, yeah, I, 10 out of 10. This outfit is giving 10 out of 10. With some cute, like, heels or even just some strappy sandals, I could really see this looking super cute. With my little, um, that it's like a hay type of look. I forget what it's called. But with that bag, stop playing with them. But yeah, this is, this is definitely cute. And I could definitely see me taking this on my next vacation with me. Now, if I'm walking, honey, if I'm walking, nah, like that's what I said, I would have to make sure I got some of my fun to hear. Because it's giving slide up. It's giving peekaboo show. Like, it's still cute, but I fear this right here. That area. <laughs> but thankfully, the, the bottom, the back is long. So I will give them that. But yeah. Actually, should I give it a 10 out of 10? It's a 10 out of 10 because it looks cute. But the skirt functionality and like being active, I would say this is for like if you're going to be standing not really like moving too much right i even need to do a sit test to see like when i sit is this still going to be covered enough we'll see we'll see actually no i'm not gonna do it on screen i will sit and i will let y'all know when i put on the next thing but i definitely like this um so i'm gonna go on to the next thing and i'm gonna do the sit test while i'm doing this just in case i don't want to flash y'all and I'm going to let y'all know how to sit went. <laughs> I'll be right back with my next outfit. All right. So I did the sit test. And oh, I don't know about the sitting. Okay. Because it was like rising. Like if you keep your legs closed real tight. Like it won't show nothing. 
of course, like, because you're wearing a skirt, like, don't have your legs all sprawled out, but it was still like, you know, you gotta, you gotta be mindful wearing that skirt. But it's still super cute, and I'm just like, I love a wrap, anything, wrap dress, wrap skirt, so... I'm, I'm gonna still work with it. Just wear some protective stuff underneath. Okay, it's giving squirt. <laughs> That's what I need to do with that. But anyways, here I am with the next item. So it is this romper, um, very colorful romper. And you know, I chose it because I just thought it would be really cute. Um, and it just looked like cute on a model. So I'll do a full 360 first. All right, so I like it. Um, I think this black band in the middle is very weird. Like if we didn't have that there, like that that would hit, you know what I mean? But I mean, I guess they did that to like show like a belt or like emphasize the waist. I'm not really sure. But I do think it's like doing something weird to the pattern. Like I would have much rather it just been that, you know? Um, but the little cup is cute for the boo. Um, and it's a really, like, really stretchy material. Um, so, like, I feel like even if I was, like, a little bigger than this, I would still fit into this comfortably. Um, and of course, I'll put all my links and sizes in the description. So, make sure you go check that out if you think any of this is cute. And I also have a discount code that you can use to go towards your purchase. Um, so... Like I said, it's, it's cute. It's doing what, it's, what it needs to do. I mean, this would pretty much be like a, you know, like, oh, I'm going to, I don't know, a picnic or I'm going to the grocery store. Like, I wouldn't do like date night or, you know, anything fancy in this, of course. Like, this is just like some, oh, let me throw this on real quick. Um, but it's still cute. If I had to rate it, I think I would give it... I give it about an eight and a half and that's just because I like it adjustable straps shout out to that because it was hanging low at first um and the design is really cute I just I don't like that right there but other than that it's still cute um and maybe I mean yeah maybe I give it a nine because why am I giving it an eight and a half you know other than this black line right here and it's a it's a decent length um it's kind of sitting right right under my butt in which I've definitely had to get over, um, get over my cellulite, like just, oh my God, I got so much cellulite on the back of my legs, honey, who cares, honestly, like, I feel like we care more than anybody, like, you might have, like, some people in their mom who like, oh, she shouldn't be wearing that, or whatever, but guess what, they ain't gonna say that shit to your face, so what's the problem, I feel like a lot of times, even with myself, like, I be in my head sometimes, like, oh, this don't look right, this don't look right, oh, I want it to feel like this, I don't want this to show, I don't want my arms to show. Like, I know there's so many girls, even girls who are not super plus size, that have body issues, they don't like their arms showing, but it's like, I feel like that shit be in our heads. We just get that shit the fuck on, because at the end of the day, even if you're, if you're body positive, body neutral, at the end of the day, you gotta accept yourself where you are. Um, so that's what I'm trying to do. Y'all know I hate my little back roll right here. I'm trying to get over it, but you know, other than that, like really try to embrace where I am at all stages because as we, sh as we may know, like it, it goes up and up and down. My weight fluctuates and I have to love myself at whatever stage I'm at. So I hope that that was some good inspiration for you to do the same thing if you've been struggling with that. Um, we gotta get out of our heads and stop being our toughest critics, you know? But anyways, um, let me see. I got a few more things and then we'll be done. So let's go on to the next thing. All right, so here I am in our next item. So it is this black and white dress. I think they call these shift dresses. I could be wrong. Um, but it's giving, you know, like, at first I was like, oh, I might be able to wear this to work. But then when I seen that little slit, and it's like, like, my butt, of course, stopped right here, and the dress is right there. I can't wear this to work. It's not even, like, the, the fingertips is fucked up, because the fingertips are touching my skin <laughs> between the fabric. 
Um, but anyways, it could still be a cute little vacation dress, you know, throw this on to, you know, go sightseeing or whatever. Um, but it's, it's definitely a different material than I expected. Like there is, mm, I would say like a 2% stretch in this. Like it's not a lot of stretch at all. So if you are going to get this, make sure you're paying attention to the size chart. I think I got a 4X, which I do with all of Shein's clothes because that's typically what fits me. But I usually wear between a 2 and 3X, you closer to a 2X. Um, but I'll do a full 360, make sure I don't flash, y'all. But it's still cute. You know, it's still giving, you know, cute summer dress. Um, and I wish that... <laughs> It could work at work, but it probably will not. They're probably like, what that girl got on? Even though, honey, I be seeing all type of shit at work. Like, people be showing up in, like, matching sets and, you know, just all type of different shit. So, maybe they wouldn't even give a fuck. <laughs> but I do. Um, but I still think the dress is really cute. Um, it's, like, it's really stocking right above my knee. Um, and I would give this dress... Let me see again. Mmm... Only because I feel like, you know, the fabric is just like, I don't know. I don't know what, what to call this fabric, but it's like not stretchy at all. Um, and it looked real silky. But anyways, I would probably get this dress at eight, eight and a half, somewhere up in there. Um, and that's just because I feel like the design could have been like, eh, teensy wings better. But it's still really cute, and I think it'll still do what it needs to do. And pair it with a nice sandal. I think it'll be really cute for the summer. They had this dress in like three or four colors. I just chose black and white because I love black and white. <laughs> um, as you'll see if you look through my pictures, I wear a lot of black. Um, but anyways. So, yeah. Still a cute dress. Um, and I can still see, like, like I said, I can still see myself wearing this out before it gets cold outside. So... Um, let's go on to our next item, which is, I believe this, uh, this denim skirt. So let me show y'all this and then I think we're going to be pretty much wrapping it up. So let's do that and I'll be right back. All right. So here I am in our final items of this haul or mini haul, I guess. <laughs> so is this denim skirt and then I got a, like three pack of these um tank top body suits so i also got them in black and white and it came as a pair like is it a pair no it came as a set of three i'll say that <laughs> so black uh, uh black tank top body suit white tank top body suit and then this olive green one i just thought i was giving Kill possible. Call me, beat me. If you want to reach me when you want to page me, it's okay. I'm sorry. I ain't seen Kill Possible in so long, so I just, <laughs> I just kind of lost it a little bit there. That that shit used to bob. But anyways, um, first of all, I want to say this is a good quality tank bodysuit. Um, I feel like it's I don't have be I be finding it so hard to find good tank tops and camisoles for some reason. Maybe I'm just not looking hard enough. Um, but you definitely don't see them in store as much as I used to. So this was definitely a good fine little basic that I could pair with a lot of things. Jeans, this, you know, anything really. But what really surprised me, honey, is this denim skirt. So let's do a full 360. Full 360. What really surprised me about this is stretchy. Like... It's stretchy denim, like a stretchy denim skirt. That is rare. I rarely see stretchy denim skirts. Like, I feel like every denim skirt I've had has been, like, very minimal stretch. And this one has some great stretch. Like, I had no issues getting into this. It was very, very easy, like, to zip and button up. Like, I, I love that. And if they have it in, like, regular, like, blue jean I'm going to probably get that too. Because I think it was one other color, but I can't remember if it was blue jean or white. Either way, honey, I'm going to go back and look for it because this is a good find. Um, and then it has like, you know, pockets up here, of course. And then it has a pocket like down here. So it's like giving utility, like, oh, I got a pocket over here too. But it's giving like, 
you know, like I said, Kim Possible, like, call me, beat me if you want to reach me. Where is Rufus, okay? <laughs> but, um, I would definitely rate the skirt a 10 out of 10, and it's not too short. It is me length, honey. Like, then I'll, you know, I could, I could sit down, honey, no problems. Like, you saw that? That was easy, up and down. Like, I was like, oh my God. Like, oh my God, y'all. So, my 10-year high school reunion was this past weekend. First of all, it was great seeing so many familiar faces, people who I haven't seen in 10 years. Some of, most of them, really, I haven't seen in 10 years since we graduated. Um, unless we went to, like, college together, too. And I was wearing this blue dress, which the dress is bad. It's cute. But... I was walking and all I was walking, oh wait, hold on, oh wait, hold on. Like, I hate having to tug at my clothes. It just makes me feel like I shouldn't have worn this because I'm not comfortable. Like, I was comfortable in the dress, but when I'm walking and I can feel stuff rising up, that shit irks me. Like, it's just like, why did I wear this? I was still cute though, don't get me wrong. But I just don't like tugging on my clothes and like having to keep readjusting. It's just too much. And then like, you know, people be like, oh, that's that dress too little for her. Ad, you know, her ass about to be out, blah, blah, You already know people be saying shit. But like I said, we can't think about them. I just know for myself, I hate tugging on my clothes anyways. Um, but like I said, you don't have to tug on this, honey. And that's what I like. So... I would definitely recommend all of the items that I got in this haul. They were all super cute. I think I selected some great items. Um, definitely some stuff that could go on vacation, that could just go out. Like I'm just going to run errands. I'm going out with my friends. I'm going to brunch. I feel like all of these could be worn to like a multitude of things. So like I said, everything will be in the description box. So make sure you go check that out as well as the discount code. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at I am Chrissy. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed already. Um, I'm definitely trying to think of like new content to bring you all. I know I do a lot of Shein reviews, um, but I'm definitely trying to broaden my scope and what I'm bringing to you all on YouTube. I might even think about filming myself doing my workouts or you know, something like that, trying to keep it fresh. Um, so if you have any ideas for me or any questions for me, definitely make sure you comment it or even send me a message on Instagram. Um, but I thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for being here. I'm trying to be consistent, y'all. I hope y'all see it. I really hope you do. Um, but other than that, I hope y'all are still having a great summer and I will see y'all next time. Peace.